What's up guys? It's Austin and Dylan here. We are over here at Brookings and Cashiers, North Carolina. Uh, Brookings Anglers. Um, it's a nice little fly shop. We want to come up here and check it out. I wanted to show Dylan this place. I thought it was pretty cool. It's my first time being over here. What do you think nice. about it? It's nice. You got a lot of fly selection. Uh, a lot of tie materials. Pretty good. They got a very good selection of rods, uh, reels, flies, uh, merchandise. Um, I've I've came up here for quite a few times now. Uh, I love being here. It's a really cool fly shop to be a part of. Um, what our plan for is today is we're going to be heading up towards uh, Cherokee, North Carolina to go fish after the kids' fishing rodeo concludes at around two o'clock on this Saturday afternoon on what's today? The, the fifth. The fifth day of August of 2023. Um, we found out about this for how long now? Just a few weeks? Yeah, just a few weeks. And from what Dylan's been telling me this morning that they're supposed to be throwing in some very nice fish. I've um, been several times years ago, but it's usually been pretty good years past, so we'll see how it does. So we're looking forward to this nice event that we'll you know get this air and It'll be pretty cool catching some big fish in Cherokee because it's been a while since I've been able to catch anything big in Cherokee. I know Cherokee's been kind of uh, on the downside as far as it being, you know, stocked and stuff like that. So hopefully we'll be able to catch a few nice decent fish and maybe take some home, maybe throw some back. We don't know. It'll just kind of depend on that. Uh, so stay tuned and we'll hope to bring you some more live action by the end of today. So. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe to our videos, and we hope to catch you up on later on today. So, all right, so for we are now fish. eligible to fish in Cherokee. We just ended up buying our license um, from Rivers Edge Outfitters. Uh, check them out if you've never been there. You've got good, friendly customer service. Um, cool little fly shop to check out. Uh, today's weather is looking like low 70s, uh, bright, shiny day uh, lots of people here at this event for the kids fishing rodeo um, hopefully we can find a spot to fish uh, there's a lot of fish in there from what me and Dylan seen hopefully we can pick a few out after two o'clock passing by and probably stay till about close to dark Ho hopefully saying that yeah uh, but other than that you know we're ready for it it's been a while since we got to fish together it's been a few weeks um, first time ever fishing up here together yeah that will be a first for us to be able to make a fishing trip out of it so stick with us and hopefully we can get some more live action going on uh, just kind of take this all day to get to where we're wanting to go and what we're wanting to do and uh, so we tried fishing the tuck earlier but that didn't work out the water was so dingy and so muddy it, it was just unfishable so we kind of scratched that part out of the, the plan for today so we're just hanging out in Cherokee until all right after. guys we are underway here at Cherokee uh, we're up here on Big Cove Road uh, a couple minutes out of town um, we're trying to just kind of kill some time for the time being uh, we had some delays come over the intercom while they was trying to do the kids fishing rodeo and whatnot. Instead of we thought of it being at two o'clock, it got pushed back to four o'clock until everybody else can fish. I don't know what the reason was with that. I don't understand. Neither does Dylan. But we're just going to kind of fish somewhere else until four o'clock and go back over there and fish. So we're going to try and see what we can get ourselves into right here. Uh, with that being said. Let's see what we can get ourselves into, shall we? See if we can fix this. Sorry for all the inconvenience issues. First Cherokee rainbow for today's trip. Oh yeah. And there it goes. All right. I 
Got my first fish of the day on this trip. I'm trying to handle this with care. Pretty Cherokee fish. And there he goes. fish from Cherokee. Let's go get him. Solid fish, turkey. Solid fish. Just caught this on, I don't know if you can see that or not, but uh, it's a light pink bead, 
size 12 jig hook, uh, waltz worm, natural hare's ear, and these fish are all about one pound average today. But this one will settle down a little bit. But it may not look big on the camera. Decent fish. Let's go catch some more. Also, I want to mention, if you haven't noticed what's on my shirt yet, we got our Halo Hunter shirts now. Um, so, we're going to give a little bit more specific details on how you could win one of these shirts at the end of this video. So, check us out at the end of this video. But make sure you watch the whole thing, though. So, Dylan, how many you got so far? Might need to speak up a little bit. How many? Caught eight so far. There you go. Just wanted to make sure everybody heard that. There you go. All right.
back up a little bit. There we go. All right. Number 12. Good fish. All right, so today we have concluded our fishing trip to Cherokee, North Carolina. Um, we had some crazy spells over the course of today. Um, one being that you'll see earlier in the video that where I almost smacked him in the eye. I basically did smack him in the eye. Yeah, mop flying it up inside my sunglasses. And I'm sorry about no, that. Yeah, it happens. But it was, it, it got me in a panic mode. Yeah, yeah. It caught me in so much of a panic <laughs> mode. I was like, oh my God, I'm about to take this guy's eye out. He ain't gonna wanna fish with me anymore. But I thank God that nothing bad or severe happened out of that. Um, we had a really nice pretty day today. It did get pretty hot. And we both sweated our butt off um, It was a beautiful day. We got to meet some new people and uh, Thank y'all for watching this video. We appreciate everything y'all do and watching us and subscribing 
by the way I, w I did say this earlier in the video um, so we do have this shirt available and just right now as far as that goes Dylan you want to say anything on that part so we're gonna do a giveaway for the hundred subscriber on our channel um, of that shirt and also maybe some flies maybe half a dozen flies uh, but yeah if you're the hundred subscriber you get that so just make sure that you do have um, us on your subscriber list uh, you like in all of our videos and whenever that 100 person becomes a sus uh, subscriber excuse me um, you might be able to get this shirt out of a hand-drawn uh, entry that you have um, we're going to try to expand our territory so to speak so where we're trying to get more products out there for y'all um, I know it's a lot for us to just be able to put this video together but it's a lot more to give it back to y'all for y'all watching us so that's the way we like to think of it would you say yeah yeah so I, I think it's pretty cool you know getting to meet new people getting to do new stuff uh trying to branch out on our own trying to make our own um, positive connection through everybody and i hope it'll go it goes a long way than just us meeting people left and right but i hope that we can expand it worldwide and nationwide and um, show our knowledge of fishing right some so, people out there you know they're just starting out yeah maybe show them something yeah so maybe we can you know sit down with y'all and if y'all have any questions about anything feel free to message us on uh our channel um we're gonna probably i ain't i ain't really asked you about this yet we, we used to go hand in hand on stuff um trying to make everything go smoothly and go well and um i'm gonna see if maybe we can even start our own instagram channel yeah we can do that so i finally have an instagram so. we, we both do if you if you don't have any idea on how to find us which i mean you're gonna find us on here but if you want to follow us personally uh trout boss unlimited or massey flies either or account for me and dylan dot gailey on instagram and i don't have as much fishing stuff on instagram i need to upload more stuff so that will happen soon so uh yeah feel free to check us out um we always trying to post fishing videos hunt videos uh, anything outdoorsy um that's that's that kind of sums it up for us um but thanks again for watching our video from today um and we did catch a good bit of fish i ended up with 12 i think he might have i got 11. he got 11 so i mean it was we pretty both close missed a lot, so. yeah um i don't know what was up with the hook set today but it was a bit off yeah. um we had to wait after two o'clock just because of some random nonchalant crazy stuff that happened for some odd reason through had the to wait till four had to wait till four o'clock so it kind of did delay our fishing time drastically and we was expecting to be at two o'clock fishing today so we did have to skip a uh, fishing trip up towards the tuck otherwise known as the tuck of cg in webster so it was a bit rough it it was just really muddy um, it's unfishable i wish we could have fished it i love fishing that place um but yeah maybe we might be able to have a video on that here soon but if you would please drop a comment and share uh your comments to us on where you would like to see us go next thanks again for watching our videos and fish on